This is GNFS News in Brief. Coming up, Ghana National Fire Service confines fire at timber market in Accra. Volta Regional Refoir gets land for office accommodation. Pendilota JF Company Limited donates the Ghana National Fire Service. And Trinity School observe kindness day at Dantuman Fire Station. A plastic processing company, a mosque, and over 100 wooden structures were salvaged by gallant firefighters at Accra Timber Market near Galaway on Wednesday, February 15, 2023. Upon receiving the call, six fire engines were dispatched to the scene to tackle the fire. No casualties were recorded. In communities like this, normally what happens is people, people cook and they leave the cooking unattended. People may be using mosquito coil, leave them unattended, or uh, they may light uh, uh, charcoal fire and may leave it unattended. So mostly, uh, these are the major causes here. Uh, some of them too are as a result of electrical uh, issues. You know here, one person will pick the uh, from the source of uh, supply and then all of them will tap in. And so electrical problems have also been part. But what we are picking now is that um, there was someone cooking, and when it happened, they tried to uh, sort it out themselves until it got out of hand. So according to them, it initially was in two of their structures. And once they tried and they couldn't, uh, this is where we are. So three fire tenders were dispatched at a go, so that uh, we won't have a situation where people complain that we came without water. And so in such situations, um, because Accra, we have a lot more stations close to each other. We do not have much of a problem when we need to mobilize. But we, need, we have such problems when it is outside Accra, the major cities, where you need to mobilize, then it means you need to call them from the various districts to come. And coming alone may take about one hour to come together. So, one thing I see, the location of this place, <laughs> how did you gain access? Um, so, you realize that, okay, we didn't come with you. But for us, even though we were using the smoke as a guide, we were also asking, where is the route, where is the route? So, they themselves were directing us where the route we should use. And so, that is how come we managed to get here. But at a point we said we've launched Jack Where Are You, which is a digital address system to be able to guide us to such locations. How come that did not come into play in this scenario? You know, when you are outside the slum areas, then you can use the digital address, which will land you perfectly to your site. Here, the routes are there, but they are blocked. And that is how come we were asking them where the route is and they were directing us as to which route to use. Because we got to a junction, we thought that was uh, the straight road leading to this place. And they said, no, this place will not go, so go to the next junction. And exactly when we got there, we got here. Volta Regional Chapter of Retired Fire Officers Association has been allocated a parcel of land which measures 70 by 70 at the Volta Regional Headquarters premises of the Ghana National Fire Service in Ho to construct an office complex. In a brief ceremony to present the land to the association on behalf of the Chief Fire Officer, the Volta Regional Fire Commander, ACF-01, Joy Ameyiboyim, commended the members of the association for staying united all these years and prayed they make the project a reality in the coming years. The measurement of the land is 70 by 70 to you, the retired fire officers of Volta region, so that you can put up an office complex for your activities. From the chief fire officer, he says, I equal to all of you for the good work you are doing to still keep the uh, unity of the organization. So we present this land to you today. We pray that next year by this time, 
you will be able to put it up and have your own premises. Thank you. Pendilota JF Company Limited has donated one Hajo motor bicycle with accessories worth 18,000 Ghana cities as part of its social responsibility. The chief executive officer of the company, Mr. Jasper Samla, said the motorbike will support the Ghana National Fire Service in its operations and, most importantly, help the service to reach people in remote and farming communities in its public fire safety and rural fire education drive. The chief fire officer, Mr. Julius Kuno, thanked the CEO of Pendilota Company Limited for the kind gesture and called on other businessmen and philanthropists to come on board and support the Ghana National Fire Service to promote national development. I'm the chief executive officer of Pendilota JF Limited, distributor for Hanju moto, motorbikes uh, in Accra. Yeah, and uh, we are here to donate a motorbike, one of our bikes to the Ghana National Fire Service. Uh, to aid their work uh, for their patrols and, and all that. And also, we are trying to establish a business relationship with Ghana National Fire Service in that some individual officers uh, are interested in owning these motorbikes to aid their mobility. So we are here to donate this to be used for a test run and other activities. And uh, we are ready to offer them on high purchase to officers who are interested. That's why we are here today. And the management, staff and pupils of the Trinity School in marking their kindness day, which coincides with Valentine's Day celebration, paid a visit to Dantuman Fire Station to appreciate the sacrifices of firefighters. Their visit was to enable the school familiarize themselves with operational equipment and interact with personnel of the station. Items including mattresses, office furniture, assorted toiletries and a brand new desktop computer were presented to the station. Pupils were taken through the skills in dowsing small fires using a wet blanket and portable fire extinguishers. More news updates, join us at GNFS Official on all social media platforms.